Good Growing is sponsored by Salisbury Greenhouse. Plants, gifts, fountains. Salisbury Greenhouse in Sherwood Park. Welcome back to Good Growing, I'm Rob Sproul again and today we're talking about house plants. Your house plants, your indoor plants, they look beautiful all summer, but in the winter, your, the light levels decrease. You might have noticed it gets dark around 2 p.m. now. So the light levels decrease and with a decrease in light levels, the plant's metabolism slows down, it needs to be watered less and its immune system goes down and it gets more susceptible to bugs. So today we're talking about how to get rid of some of the most common bugs. Most common bug, of course, is aphids. Little critters, about yay big, the size of a head of a pin. You can't miss them, but they do come in all shapes and sizes. They cluster on new growth of the plant. You probably don't have to buy a product to get rid of aphids. You have to take a cloth, get some hot soapy water, uh, like dish soap, palm olive is the best. Take a cloth and wipe down the plant, the leaves, up and down. It, very important to get the underside as well. So you wash it down without hot soapy water. It clogs their pores and uh, and kills them. And if that doesn't work, you can try some insecticidal soap. It's an over-the-counter. It's basically hot soapy water in a bottle. And you spray that on over the leaves and under the leaves. You have to do this treatment every week for a few weeks to make sure to nip the eggs and, and finish the life cycle. You would never want to use anything too harsh in the home because it is the home. It's a contained environment and you're breathing that air. So that's how to get rid of some aphids on your house plants. That's today on Good Growing. Good Growing is sponsored by Salisbury Greenhouse. Plants, gifts, fountains. Salisbury Greenhouse in Sherwood Park. <laughs>